Hi folks, a very warm welcome to you. My name is Nick and we're going racing, rock and roll racing in fact, on the Super Nintendo or SNES. It's been published by Interplay in 1993 for one to two players, but I'm the only player here. There's lots and lots of tracks on this one and rock and roll music. Um, you can progress to different planets, different tracks, and it's password based so um, you can save your progress pretty uh, much. So it's heavy metal, rock racing, we've already reviewed this game on the Game Boy Advance I think, and the Mega Drive, so we'll see how this one compares as well. But those other ones were a lot of fun, and all the time there's occasional commentary from Larry Loudmouth Huffman. So here's the, here's the different players we can pick from. All their vehicles have got different sort of like performance levels, that's a Chewbacca sort of character, I think I might select him. Katarina Lyons jumping and cornering. So you've got different uh, methods of firing. I think there's two weapons and a jump. Um, you have to ease off the accelerator around corners, but learn the track. It's going to start off quite basic. This is my first go on this particular version, so we'll see how far we get. These reviews are always from the standpoint of your first or second go. It's pretty groovy so far. A choice of three cars. We've got money 20,000. Uh, we can't afford that car on the uh, right there. On the left, I should say. You can give it a new paint job, but I think we'll kick stick to it being red. Red or dead, baby. Red or dead. There's the options there. Buy equipment, advance a level. Now, we're in Division B. We need to get a certain amount of points we can do by winning certain races uh, to get to the next uh, one. Uh, here's all your upgrades here. We've only got 2,000 after buying that car. Uh, tires, uh, armor, weapons, all that sort of stuff. So it's all there. The music is awesome. Here we go, the first race. So this, the music. Thanks, Larry Lambmouth. I'm the red car. Oh my god, it's sliding around a little bit. Now I seem to seem to feel like I'm seeing less of the screen than the Mega Drive version, but it might be just my imagination. Uh, we're on a rookie mode, so I shouldn't have too much of a problem here. One would have fought. Right, we've got weapons, we can do jumps. See across the top there, uh, that first icon is boosts. Uh, oh, I think so. Or firing, the second is boosts, and this third is something else, and jumps. Uh, the map is on the top left, you can see this is just a, a square, and I'm dominating the race. Vehicle combat, rock and roll music. Now, there's quite a few tracks on this one, as I try and concentrate. We've got uh, the songs are Bad to the Bone, which featured in the Terminator 2, or Terminator 1 so uh, film, I think it's Terminator 2. Highway Star, Paranoid by Black Sabbath, Peter Gunn, Born to Be Wild as well. Right, let's go. Yo! Right, go. If you've got this game on any system, let me know. I, I can't remember if it came out on the Amiga or not. I don't think it did. I don't think so. This is a bit someone says, you've reviewed it on the Amiga. Oh, well, okay. Yeah, it's pretty good fun on the Game Boy Advance. I played it a lot on that. Turbos, this looks like fairly easy. Look at my red dot. If a vehicle takes too much damage, it will explode. I'll have to keep my eye on the uh, time here because racing games I like the most, and I do tend to uh, the views tend to be longer. Those the wheels are turning. Good animation there. Good frames. It's good. I think we have to do about three laps each turn. First place knockout. A week. Another time zone. So there we go. I've got 400 points. I think I need about 1,400. I think to progress to Division A. Right there we go. So money 15,000. Need 1,400 yet. Yeah, at the bottom there, I have 400. So you can uh, upgrade your car. Let's buy some equipment. I don't think we can get too much for 15,000. Ideally, I want to improve my turning circle because where I'm losing most of the time is the grip around the corners, I think. Uh, there's degrees of uh, these. You can see at the bottom there, there's a yellow uh, square and it will progress forward to the right so it's full up to maximum. So you can just tell you, this is a bit of a grinding game. You could spend hours and hours on the thing. So starting off fairly easy, we've done one race of eight in this division. You can turn Larry off if you want, but we won't do. We like Larry. Although he does tend to say the same thing over and over again. So let's have a different uh, tune here. Tune. Let the carnage begin! Let the carnage begin! I'm available for any voiceover work, for any Drivers games uh, that you want. Thank you very much. Well, line. yes, we'll negotiate. It's the final lap. Right, my car's smoking now, taking a bit of damage. Uh, it might explode. It's a nice good jump there. You see that there's upgrades, whoops, upgrades on the track, which might be extra money to spend in the store. Uh, repairs, 
um, to prevent your car from exploding. And there's other like bombs and stuff you don't want to go on. So I'm in fourth place at the moment. Fourth place doesn't get any money. And I, I really need to, yeah, I said it was too easy. No, first of all, I'm, I'm, I'm having bother on this one. Right, come on. A tighter track, but as you can see, it's not overly complicated by the map on the top left. Let's bash through this mob. Whoa. Right, okay. Big chunky cars to control here. As I say, you're not seeing much of the track in front of you, so it, it, you have to learn where you are. But you could have a quick glance up the top left, as I say, to see where the next bend's going to be. And time it right, and you're going to get some uh, good turnings. He's about to blow! Go, 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 Nick. Go, go, go. Right, it's turbo. Oh, okay. there's a bit of money there. That yellow one was money to spend in the store, which I needed. So the the um, if you're not very good at racing games, the learning curve on this is very, very, very gentle, unless you put it on a higher level to first of all. But it is good, it is going to gradually catch up as you get further on. So I just fire some green stuff at someone. Now I'm out of charges. I've got one boost left, but the car is smoking again. Uh, you do lose some time, but the car explodes for it to regenerate back on the starting position. So you don't want that to happen on the last lap. I'm dominating the race, right? So the tracks are like red here. I think the next level is like blue, but we won't do that because that would take way too long. Another time zone. I thought he was going to say that. So you know, if you get annoyed with Larry because he, he doesn't say a great deal of stuff, then you can like easily turn him off. But it's a good fun racing game. Probably a bit more fun in two players, but one player is still going to give you a bit of a challenge as well. So we're up to twenty-eight thousand. I should be able to buy something here. Uh, buy equipment. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Right. Let's see where we are here. So we got uh, the armor, which will prevent you from smoking. I suppose you can take more damage. Uh, there's is a these are like different weapons. We've got all these got these on we weedy things, hydro spanners. I really need uh, tires or something like that. Twenty eight thousand. Oh, we need thirty thousand for the road warrior tires, which is extra grip really. So we'll keep saving. We keep on saving, Mobius. So let's go to race three. We've already got 800 of the 1400 we need to progress to the next league. So you might not necessarily need to complete the uh, uh, league. The stage is set. The green flag drops. Okay, Larry. Oh, look at that. I tried to get it. Oh, I took the blast here, so he's taking some damage. Yeah, I'm skidding all over the place. I definitely need that extra traction. Got another good tune playing as well. Oh, there's a jump as a figure. Figure of eight's like jump here now. There's some health, which I got bashed out of the way, and I desperately needed that because I'm, I'm smoking like a nincompoop. These cars are... God, I missed that one as well. These cars are taking pretty wide lines around here. Right, okay, I've got some money power-ups and I've got some health, and now you see the car's no longer smoking. Small reflections sometimes off the cars, but not a great deal. It's not like it's ray tracing. Sometimes I think the sun might catch the, uh, the, uh, the windscreen as we go around the corner, if you see it full on. Who's going the wrong way? Hopefully not me. Right, I'm in first place, it says. Laps two, left. Go, go, go. Jump. You don't want to jump at a wonky angle there, but I'm miles in the lead here. Do, 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 do. Is that from the Blues Brothers? Right, last lap. It's the final lap. Come on, Nick. Turbo. Streets around the corners. Good skid noises as we go around. This game is a lot of fun. It doesn't take itself too seriously. Starts off fairly easy. Loads and loads of tracks. Loads and loads of playability. So it's going to be a long, long one. And a lot of people would have got addicted to this game. It does gradually draw you in. A nice little game on the Super Nintendo. Quite a lot of, quite a lot of good racing games on these like consoles. And I, I love looking at them. Good stuff. Right, so we go. So I'm first again. So I've won. I've won every race essentially. I'm not doing too badly. Right, so that's three races of eight that have been run. Maximum points. I've got forty-one thousand. Let's buy something super cool. Uh, right, tyres. Ideally, I need. Uh, okay. Oh no. Oh dear. I bought. I bought. I bought that turbo thing in error. I hit the wrong button. Oh well. Uh, we should be go. Well, our grip won't be great, but we should be able to go a bit faster here. Oh, there, that was pure nincompoopery. So, see, there's two yellow dots on my turbo thing. So, uh, yes. But we was much quicker than, well, I think on the straights, we was much quicker than the other cars anyway. But I uh, should be sliding over. Get your motor running. What's Step the onto the begin? highway. Get your motor running. Step onto the highway. Looking for adventure. 
or whatever comes my way. You gotta make it happen, baby. Right, go, go, go. Come on, speed round. I'm dominating the race. We've got super speed now. I've ain't just feather the frost around the corners. That seems to be working for me. Good. So that's going to be a bit more control of the car. So instead of just taking your finger off and letting go, just keep tapping it. Ease off, then just keep tapping it around the corner. And you shouldn't be doing too badly. I'm thrashing everyone here. Whoa, God, I lost a bit of grip there, but I could probably stop and have a sandwich. I'm so much better than the rest of the field at the moment with his extra turbo power. Right, two laps to go, two laps left. I wonder if we can lap anyone. That'd be quite nice, wouldn't it? Ivan, is that me? He must be. It's not Ivan Stewart, anyway, from Ivan Stewart Super Off-Road Racing. The best thing about this game is just like the music and the graphics are pretty cool as well. I, I presume it's all fully licensed. It's, it's chip music, so it's different enough. But it wasn't the other versions, so I wouldn't get some sort of like copyright claim. So we should be okay in that when I'm talking all over it. No one's going to want to record the music with me over it, are they? I wouldn't have thought so. Right, money pick up. Good. Look out for the yellow stuff. So we're just grinding here, we're going to win the race, no problemo, and we've done it. We're just trying to collect money to upgrade our car so we can kick butt, if we're just going to continue to play, uh, kick butt on the final step. Now if you're still here, well done you, a lot of people just watch the first three or four minutes just to get a gist of the game. If you're still here, that means you're an aficionado of the uh, channel, so thank you very much. If you haven't subscribed already, please consider doing so because that helps it continue. Um, yes, thank you. And if you want to become a member, huge thank you to the members. Click on the join button and that helps me do more and more and more videos and keep the thing on track. Ideally, I'd like to be full time. I've tried it a couple of times, but then run out of money. <laughs> but uh, we'll keep going and maybe have another go at it at some time in the future. So thank you very much. If you get a chance, drop in at a live stream as we are bad to the bone. Bad to the bone. Bad. Seeing you bag to the bone as I'm smoking from the back now. Ooh, if you're smoking from the back, then comment below. Right, hang on now. Just, this, is, this is a bit more bully boy tactics here. Always free uh, riders, but uh, they always go wide, so we'll probably get on the inside as I've done there. Definitely need a bit of health. Don't want to bash the sides too much. Look on the red... Oh dear, I've blown up. I've hit a landmine. So now I've got a bit of work to do here. But we've got three laps to do it in. Not all the pickups on the track are good pickups. Right, that's kaboomed him. Well, I've sort of like kaboomed him. Uh, what other? Look at my upgrades I've got left. Yeah, I'm much quicker down the straight, so I can just take the inside and drive past all of them. Should be okay now. Should be okay. I, I was in last place, but within a lap, I got in front of all of them. Got some uh, armor power up there as, as well. Ease off, ease off. I just take it easy, you don't need to be a hero here. Oops, yes, that was bad driving, I would have failed my test. So you've got a choice of, uh, well, you've got a choice of three cars, but at the start you can only form two. Uh, each one is just the uh, aesthetics, really. Uh, you can change the uh, colour, well, I don't think you can change the colour unless you buy another car, but anyway, you're trying to save up, I think, for the Marauder car, which is the best out of all of them. I don't know if you have to start your upgrades from the start again there, but, uh, you know, you might be able to tell me. If you completed this game, let me know. Um, how long does it take? I'm presuming a good, a good few hours. I'm just going to do the first league here to show you the initial tracks, give you an idea if you want to track this game down or not, and I would say yes. It's got a good arcade feel to it. I like the characters. They're not from anywhere in particular. Uh, but uh, Viper McKay and Rip, or R.I.P. I suppose. It's supposed to be something off uh, that. So, uh, races run 5 of 8. Hurrah! Right, so, what we got? What, 27,000. I don't think we've got enough of the tyres, have we, that I really uh, wanted. Yeah, we need 30,000 for those. So, Nick, don't get the wrong thing next time. Just go forward. Uh, I think, uh, look at that, so if we could progress to the next league if we wanted to, we need 1,400, uh, we've got 2,000. Right, here we go. Is this, is this Black Sabbath? Is this Paranoid? I don't know. I am driving round the bend. La 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 la, something something unforgettable. Right, here we go. Nice jump there, well, that's wasted that power up anyway, with a bit of booze, let's go. 
man. I'm not sure if uh, Ozzy Osbourne ever played this game. Okay, so I don't think he did. Wait, right, that's money power up. Good. Armor power. I thought that was help, but that's armor. Right, that always helps. He often repairs the car, though, that armor stuff. This is the trickiest track so far. But we seem to have, like, a variation of two tracks at the moment. Well, three tracks, if you include the figure of eight stuff. Biff, 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 back. Viper is about to blow. Who's there? Well, it's not me, anyway. Right, go. So, you know, I could have progressed to the next league already, so if you're getting bored of these tracks, you could zip on a little bit. Uh, Berber. Hope you're having a good time. It's all about stress bus in this channel. It doesn't take itself too seriously. But there's a hundred and hundred reviews on this channel. So if you want to have a bit of a binge watch, if you're a bit bored today or ill, you can watch stuff over and over again. I think, uh, I think it's probably about a couple of months worth, maybe even longer if you want to watch everything. Uh, to get to the playlist, you click on my username, that takes you to the channel page. So try and zip round here. Uh, and then click on the playlist tab, or video if you want. You click on the playlist tab and that'll take you to the individual different systems if that's what you want to look at. Ahead, walk back to 902. Right, look at all those uh, poles down there. A bit of blurring down the bottom there as we go along. Well, that's okay. You shouldn't be looking at the uh, the columns holding the track up. You should be just looking at the racing. Already, this review has been going on a bit longer than I have had. It's a, it's a review of type, really. It's really a gameplay review of, you know, your first or second go, as I said before. So don't expect uh, expert gameplay. Dodgy gameplay, nonsense shit. Yeah, that's what it's all about. Right, we should be able to get the tyres now, which I was trying to get in the first place. The Road Warriors. Good, we've got them. Them. I think the next tyres are the Super Marauders, so we should have a bit more grip this time, so we should be able to thrash these easy people a bit more than normal. Right, 6 of 8, you have 1400, yeah, there we go. Biff! Um, yeah, we could, you could change the, uh, no, you can't, I think you, um, yeah, you need, uh, you need 18,000, I thought you could change the paintwork, whether that'll give me a blue car, I don't know. I think you have to buy a whole new car at some point. It's not like Top Gear, uh, where you can change the colour of the car at any point. Right, start race, big nose. Right, shall we make this the last race? Maybe. You've got an idea of it. Right, so it's the figure of eight again. We should be out of fresh might even more now. Look at the amount of power-ups on this track. Yeah, much tighter circle. I'm drifting less. I'm drifting. Oh, that's a, we don't have a mine there. We didn't want to do that. Let's cause some damage, whee! So you can see, once get a, maybe get a bit of an idea. Once the uh, car is fully upgraded, feel the speed that this thing is going to go uh, around. You'll need lightning reflexes as you zip around. Um, the, the opponent cars are going to get a lot uh, more challenging and bash you around a bit as you go forward. But already now, just with a couple of upgrades, my car is, is not a not a match for them. It's just leaving them leaving them miles behind. Uh, look at that! I'm all, I'm probably about half a lap in front. So if you're a newbie frustrated with these sort of like isometric linear sort of like view racing games, this one will be the one for you. You can start on whatever level you want, really, of a difficulty. So you know you can make probably loads and loads of mistakes and still get a bit of fun out of that. The gameplay is very, very forgiving, and you're gonna have some great tunes to uh, take you around the track as well. I can highly recommend this game. It's a big fun game, uh, for multiplayer as well, be awesome too. Right, go, well, say multiplayer, it's two players, isn't it, really? First place, knockout. And this Larry Loudmouth, I'd, I'd, like, I'd, like uh, I'd like to meet up with him. He's in another time zone. Is he really, Larry? Well done, Larry. If you are Larry Loudmouth, then comment below, Huffman. Right, so we've got, we got 21,000. Uh, the car isn't upgraded a great deal, but already the performance is improving. When the car's going super fast, look at that plasma rifle. When the car's going super fast, uh, races won't last very long at all. Right, I've upgraded that. That's like hydro springs or something. I think the car will bounce less, maybe, when it uh, hit the ground, so you got more traction with the uh, track. But I might be making this up. I'm no, I know. So we race. We might, we might as well just do one last race then, the last race of the season. What's it going to be? What the carnage? How long has this review been going on? About 16, 17 minutes, something like that, roughly. So it takes about, let's, let's just say, each lead takes about 20 minutes, maybe, roughly. 
Duh, 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 duh. So it's this, well, it's a variation of the track again. A few tight corners, but I, you know, I'm quite confident I've got this one. Rock and roll racing. Elvis Presley isn't here. He meant it rock and roll, apparently. Um, or sausage rolls or something like that. Thank you very much. Elvis is not here. It's like uh, it's like 80s rock, I suppose. It may be a bit 70s. Boom! Viper looks lost out there. Well, he does look lost, but we're, we're miles away. We're miles away from them. So, once you get used to this, maybe start it again on a higher difficulty uh, level, I would say. But it's, it's, it's fun learning the mechanics uh, of this. When I'm this far ahead, it does feel like a bit beaterish, like I'm just testing out the uh, dynamics. Um, for me to lose now on, on with this advantage, it's, uh, it would be an absolute disaster. Great. Boof. Boof, 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 boof. Yeah, a good old, a good old quality game. Good old quality game. This nice, nice red car. One day, hopefully, someone will remake it in VR. Can you imagine that? Where you see actual the um, your hands on the steering wheel as you go around. That'd be pretty cool on this one. I mean, I could probably just just get that. There we go. I can take my time. Mind you, I've let the cars get a little bit closer now. But anyway, maybe I could should turn around and go the wrong way around. Maybe I can do that. No, we not do that. Because Larry Lowmouth will get super excited. They're going the wrong way around the track. Boof. Here we go. I think we will leave it there. So I hope you liked having a look uh, at that game. As I say, you know what I think about it, but say what your thoughts are. That was Rock and Roll Racing, published by Interplay 1993 on the SNES or Super Nintendo. We can advance the next league if we want to do uh, there. So yeah, good, good stuff. Please put your comments, as I say, about that below. I love reading your comments there. Until next time, take great care of yourself and a very fond goodbye. Goodbye.